first of all, I'm drawing a line where the school is going to begin. Then I'm filling up that space with white body paint. I'm tracing out the eye socket, filling it in and setting it with a black eyeshadow. This makes it last longer. Don't worry if you mess up, you can always go back to that white body paint and fix your mistakes. I'm drawing my waterline with a black eyeliner and tracing out and filling in a triangular shaped nose and setting it with black eyeshadow. I'm drawing a line beneath my cheekbones and this oddly shaped thing. It is easier for you to just look at that video instead of me trying to describe it. Anyways, I'm filling it in and setting with black eyeshadow. I'm tracing out a hole where my teeth are going to be and within that I'm drawing a line which is going to define where my teeth are going to end. Now, surprise surprise, I'm drawing another line connecting my lips with that oddly shaped blob and a bunch of little lines that are going to be the teeth. I'm shading around my new teeth to make them look more realistic and brightening them with a white body paint. Now I'm going back to the black body paint and defining each line again. After shading the teeth some more, I'm going back to the black body paint and making a rim around each hole by making a line next to it. I'm then shading each rim with black eyeshadow and highlighting it with white body paint. I'm doing some more shading, but it's easier to just show you than me trying to describe it to you. I'm also shading out my temple and going back and forth between shading and highlighting the rims until I like it. Here I'm doing another crack, cleaning up around it, and then I'm putting white body paint into my hair because I just thought it looked more spooky. Continuing on my neck and chest, I'm leaving out white space for my collarbones and vertebrae. I'm going back and forth between coloring everything in until I'm somewhat satisfied with how it looks. I'm shading all around the rim of my actual face to make the skull look more deep. I'm taking white body paint mixed with my makeup and lifting up the skin where it transforms into the skull. Mixing red with brown eyeshadow and applying it with a fluffy brush next to the highlight we just made to make the skin look irritated. I'm also taking red body paint and applying it next to the rim. It kind of makes it look like dried blood and I really like it. I'm just applying lipstick and coloring my ear black and that's the finished look. 